It's such an accessible thing. And there's a, there's a stigma attached, especially for a male. If you can't handle that, oh, you know. But if that leads to much worse behaviour, then yeah. it's difficult. It's really difficult. It's impacted me. It's impacted me and everybody. Um, it has all through the years, but more so now when things have reached a kind of peak now. And it's impacted on everybody from the smallest people in the wider family to the very oldest people in the family. Physical health distress impact um, mental health also. Just the, the, the limiting of being able to associate with other members of the family if this um, just volatile person is in the home. Um, if someone gets into trouble, you want to help them out. Um, if someone gets into trouble one day but I'm supposed to be working that day, then I'll just stop my work and go and help. Impacts on my work, impacts on my finances, impacts on other another member of the family's finances as well because they want to help even though they're frustrating them. But why would they want someone to be going through hardship when they have one to sort it out regardless of whether you should or not? As you walk that way and you walk that tightrope every day, did I make the right decision that day? I don't know. I hope so. I, I feel stress. So I have a headache. So I need to take like a paracetamol or an ibuprofen or something like that to get myself to sleep around no sleep. So the next day that impacts whatever it is that I'm doing. I mean, that's that's tiny. I've had a couple of hours even I before. But I just, I, I don't like to take these things. But yeah, it's like, well, I'll have to now. It's, it's everywhere. Oh, we're going to ask that. Three boxes of this for £20 and it isn't that great. No, it isn't great. I'd never thought about that before because I'd never realised the impact that would have on the likes of the person in my life or whoever that people are. It's such a culturally acceptable thing and it's such a, you can't say you can't do it. Nobody would have that thought about drugs. Nobody would have that thought about prescription medication or anything weed. Any, nobody would say that, but they say about alcohol as if it's like nothing. Carnage, carnage in people's lives, carnage across the world. But yeah, get your three boxes for 20 quid at Asda. And if you're in recovery from drug use or like prescription drug use or anything like that, you're not going to be walking down the street and see a billboard on the side of a bus. Come and get your, come and get your weed here, come and get your coke here, it's just not going to happen. But it, it, it was such a realisation that people who struggle with alcohol will have to deal with that every single day, they can't get away from it. And I thought, that's shocking. The folk don't bat an eye.